What's up, YouTube? Mco40 here. I want to talk to you guys today about the brand new Insector deck that got first place of YCS Seattle. I wanted to run through some of his card choices in general and just tell you guys what I think about my deck. Or, not my deck, his deck. Sorry. Um, first off, double card trooper. Uh, double card card D. It's very good to see a deck actually win with card card D now. Um, one dark arm dragon. In a lot of his feature matches, and in matches in general, I heard that he used this card to get the win. It does a lot of work in today's current format. And then the Insector Engine, triples in a beat. One Dragonfly, one Giga, one Hornet, uh, three Ladybug. This actually really surprised me, uh, just in general. I was surprised to see him maxing out on this. But, you know, it's another Insector that you can equip onto it and, you know, do some damage to your opponent. Uh, one Sangin, one Reaper, and then double guides. One Dark Hole, one Foolish Burial. Um, only one Forbidden Lance. This actually kind of surprised me because, you know, you want your summon to be, you know, successful. But he is playing Triple Call the Haunted, so if it gets torrential, you know, things will work out. Uh, Heavy Storm, doubles at Caliber. Um, Monster Reborno, uh, Triple MST. Once again, you want to make sure those summons go off. Uh, double Duality. Triple call. If they torrential or do something nasty to you, you just call it back. And then double compulse, double solemn warning, and then triple threatening roar. A uh, roar was probably his key card in my opinion, just because you know you can go card card D with the roar. Uh, next turn your opponent tries to go off to blow up the roar, you just chain roar. Your opponent stops automatically. So excellent tech. Uh, side deck, double max C, double Raiko, double system down, double Gozen. Uh, double Decree, and then Triple Soul Drain, <laughs> anti mermail Anti-Dark World, it's so good. And then Double Tarantula. And then as for his extra deck, uh, one Adreas, one Gachi, one Levier, uh, one Maystroke, one number 12, actually very surprising to see him playing number 12, I'm not sure why. Um, number 17, Leviathan times 2, Giga Brilliant, Acid Golem. Utopia, Temtem Tempo, Tiras, Zen Maiho, and Double Zen Mains. So once again, I think that his victory was accustomed to Threatening Roar itself, uh, just because of the chain ability power, and then, you know, you blow up the stuff on the field to make the counterattack. So, I like the deck, I understand why it did so good. Let me know what you guys think about the deck in the comments down below. Sectors finally did it, and just after they got neutered. So, leave a comment down below, guys. I would appreciate to hear from you guys, and I'll talk to you guys later on. Later.